Thank you so much for joining us, and we are talking to Gino. Okay, Gino, the Greek, That's Stavros. Me. Let's do it. Um, uh, first of all, are you shocked to be here right now, truly, deeply? Honestly, I'm shocked and I'm pissed. Obviously, <laughs> we saw the sticky gummy situation that happened. I made a decision to put the gummy in there. Did I really want to put it in there? I didn't. I just want to show them that I was loyal to them. And do I have regrets? I do, because I knew that if I was to be on the block beside Josh, the house could just flip, and that's what happened. So. Okay, well, um, I was watching all this go down mm -hmm. on the live feeds. Yep. Tell me and about it. you don't understand. My jaw was on the floor. Everyone <laughs> watching was losing their minds. And then you hear there's one hour until the ceremony. All right. Okay, but at that point, I, 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 you talked to Marty. Why couldn't you have said, Marty, I know I put my gummy in there. It's too dangerous. This could be, this could be looked at as, a, as another backstab. Mm -hmm. Don't do it. So I did talk to Marty afterwards. Yeah. And I tried talking sense to him. It just made sense. Very calmly. Very calmly. Too but calmly. I, at that point, I was boiling the inside. I was actually pissed. I'm like, Marty, are you seriously doing this a third time? Um, and we had the opportunity of backdoor him the other the week before. Mm. I kind of played that we had the secret power and I knew about it, but I yeah. didn't. Um, but in the moment, I told Marty, I'm like, I'm telling him, like, it doesn't make sense putting me on the block. Maybe he would have changed his mind. But but if logic didn't work, why didn't you flip into another gear? I know you've got it. I did. I did. I should have. I should have. And I regret it. That's the part I regret oh. the most because I know if I would have done it, he would have probably put up maybe JC Lynn or Kevin, and that would save my game, and I would have probably still been in there. But it is what it, it is. It is what it is. And is it, listen, it's not real life. I know that. Yeah. But it was your life. It was my but, life. Right? It, yeah. it really was. It really was. Um, now, I'm curious, still on a game level, why on earth did you think you could trust this five? Remember, out of the five, two people, including Marty, Marty and Helena, had tried to evict you during mm -hmm. the chain of safety. So why did you have so much trust? So basically, when we got together, we took, like, huge hits. We took out... T, mm -hmm. we took out Okay, but between that, <laughs> they almost took you out. I know, I know. But I, I, at that point in the game, I had JC Lynn, um, and I had nothing else, right? It was just me and JC Lynn. And I thought working with these five and keeping them close would be the best move for my game. Mm -hmm. um, Do you wish now that you had found other avenues? Because you did have did. other relationships. So I started building with Josh and Betty, mm -hmm. and I hope I was wishing that that would work. And then I would come, turn around and like attack Marty. Mm -hmm. But obviously he put up Josh and Betty on the block, and that, um, at that point I had to stay on Marty's good side. That was my whole theory, mm -hmm. stay on his good side. He is a walking target in the house. I'm gonna be the next target. So that was my game plan, and obviously it just blew up in my okay, face. Okay, yeah, speaking of game plan, <clears throat> first of all, mm -hmm. you had two of the most successful HOHs. You're the only one who didn't <laughs> lose their mind right? to <laughs> I mean, we had people go from HOH to out the door, mm -hmm. right, um, several times this season. Um, you proved you were here to play when you were like, sorry, Kyle, got to go. You're my boy, but everybody's coming for you. You're bad for my game. Yeah. So you did that. But Moose, you definitely had an independent relationship with Moose. Do you regret that decision? He really wanted to work with you. Yes, he really did. But the thing with Moose is he's a good talker. He's a sure great is. talker. He's in everybody's ears. I felt like he was playing the middle of the game. Um, and he was pulling both sides, mm -hmm. and I just didn't feel safe with him because I, f I felt like if he won HOH, I'd probably be on the block. Right. He would try to break that showman's. So I, I did want to keep him close, and that week I wanted to evict, obviously, Marty, mm -hmm. backdoor him, and that didn't work out. So for me to have Whoa, him... whoa, whoa. Okay, you're not going to yada yada that one. We're going to bring him okay, back. Okay, 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 okay. So your HOH, Marty has... You guys have a very tumultuous relationship. Yeah. Like, it never got heated between you two, but, you know, he definitely proved to be untrustworthy to you. 100%. Yeah. Right? Um, and then, like, obviously, you knew JL had, had the, uh, sorry, JC Lynn had <laughs> uh, the secret veto. Yeah. But you didn't know that when no. you were giving advice. No, I think Marty's a bigger target than us. We should keep him around. Do you regret that? Because that was a head, a head scratcher. No, I do. Honestly, um, Marty should have went a long time ago. He backstabbed me twice. And I felt... In the moment, I felt like in my gut, like it was the right move to keep him. But originally, that was my plan, and I wish I went through it with it. But, you know, it's part of the game. You're in your head. You get paranoid. Yeah. And you start thinking, and it just ended up the way it ended up, right? So Listen, it's easy for everyone out here watching because mm -hmm. we see everything, and you guys just don't. Yeah. Um, one question a lot of people are going to have is your relationship with JC Lynn. Was that real? 
She is a sweet, amazing girl. Honestly, she kept me sane in the game, and I'm kind of grateful I actually started to talk to her and we got so close. Um, honestly speaking, without her, I don't know how my game would have went. Mm -hmm. um, and obviously, we started working together, and every time, everything we did, it was the same headspace we had, so I enjoyed having her around. Uh, and it was the only time in this game that I'd, when I spent time with her, it was like I wasn't playing the game anymore. Mm -hmm. It was just me Could and that her. have been a problem? Well, that, that could have been a problem. And it, was a little of a problem, <laughs> but I enjoyed it. It was actually kept me sane. And yeah, I was yeah, yeah. Happy, of course, so. you have to live. You exactly, have to live. Exactly right. We're all human beings, right? You can't be a game bot all the time. Mm -hmm. It's impossible. Um, so, who do you want to see coming behind you in jury? I'd like to see Marty. Mm -hmm. I'd like to see Kevin. Sure. And Helena. Okay. <laughs> Obviously, we know why Kevin and Helena. They kind of flipped on me, and Marty. He just played me twice. Played me a third time, Oof. and he's still in the house. So and that does not sit well with me. Rough. There are some very good players in that game. Oh, yeah, there is. Very, Strong very good players, players, good yep. social game. Mm -hmm. Not always comps, that's it, the thing. Yes, it is a big social game, and I didn't realize that coming to the house and then seeing... But you were so well-liked, too. I mean, you had a really flawless social game going mm -hmm. for a long, long time. Yeah, so that's what I, that was my game plan, being on everybody's good side. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to step on toes. That's why my HOHs were so clean. Yeah. And I just wanted they people were. to see that. and. Sometimes being the nice guy is not always the best thing to do, Oh, right? my God. So. so many people are devastated mm -hmm. that yeah. you're out. Let me tell you. Um, and so who do you think is going to win? Who's got the biggest win equity? Um, who I would like to see win is Jason, and obviously. Mm -hmm. Marty, I see him coming out very soon. So I'd go with either Summer or Josh. Wow, okay. Josh is a lovable guy, mm -hmm. calm beast. He's about to win an HOH sooner or later. He's been coming to the end quite often. Uh, Summer is just a great social game. She's all over the house. Summer's She's, amazing. Oh my god, I, I love her. I actually enjoyed having her around. She was a lot of fun. We know, we mm -hmm. know. <laughs> Listen, uh, Gino, you're gonna have an amazing time, and you, mm -hmm. you are gonna have so much fun. It's a nice way to, yeah. to decompress before you're back for finale. I can't wait to see you then. Yeah. All right. Me too. <laughs> Listen, I love getting all the juicy house guest details. But speaking of juicy, make sure you head on over to Wendy's to grab a Dave's single, a quarter pound of juicy fresh. Never.